On the night in question, Miss Raddick took you home? Yes. She was helping me with Fran and Fowler. I couldn't have gotten through without her. Does any of that help you involve having them in your bedroom? Not in the way that you mean. I mean, the way I mean. So you're the tough question. Tell me what I mean. You're implying there was some sexual contact. But there wasn't? I helped him place pillows and put things within reach. What? Uh, small things. Like your cell phone, water, pain pills. And how long did that take? Ten minutes. You were in the bathroom for only 10 minutes. No. Then how long? I, I don't know. I, he's exhausted for probably most of the time. You thought that worked for two hours and 15 minutes? And our marriage. And why it didn't work out. And why didn't it? Listen, I don't think they're going to have to. If it makes you uncomfortable, they will. We were trying to remember the last time that we were in the hospital together. And it was in the last year of our marriage. I had ruptured my appendix, and Adrian was in the hospital with us. Baby came night and day. So he was very good in emergency situations. So this was your chance to return the favor? Yes. What did returning the favor entail? What did Lewis say? Well, we'd rather get you in there. <laughs> So Liv started humming a song to me that I had just found with that. One bright night in when my life is over. Both ready. We can't wait anymore. Yes, I know, Your Honor. I think Mr. Blum might have had a dental appointment, but it went too long. Well, get him in here. Get him in here this afternoon. Mr. Blum, where are you? You missed court. Mr. Chris, Mr. Blum? Did you bring granola? Well, wake up. Well, wake up. I can't say the word. You give me too much. I'll go back to court. I wouldn't mind that. What's that about? Honest. Make it six months. I'll get some time. Six months for murder. Six months, and you get a conviction if you're the person responsible. Baby, you want one big conviction, not two small ones. Done. I hope 
You've got a gun. Why? You just screwed over the one. one. I had a ruptured appendix when we were married, and Adrian stayed with me in the hospital and sang I'll Fly Away for me. I was returning the favor. For three hours. I wanted to wait for you to make your scene. Anything else, counsel? One more thing, Your Honor. I have an affidavit from Detective Pedro. And when you left Mr. Bozeman's residence that night, he followed you to the right. Uh, objection, Your Honor. This is crazy. He followed her? Why was he following her when he was there to protect Mr. Bozeman? Because he was actually there to spy, obviously. But what did he find? He saw you purchasing in that Rite Aid a non-prescription morning after pill. Did he have that correct, Ms. Redick? Your Honor, I'd like to recess to review this affidavit. 